So I came to Babel King this morning, hang out with my friend. She's running that way, not particularly because she hates me, but... <laughs> but because we are having an issue with the fact that our breakfast ended and we need to run for a particular reason. I'm going to catch up with her in a second. But it's a nice place. Got myself an egg bagel with like smooth lox spread, which was delicious. Even though I'm scared that probably like in about an hour I'm not going to feel good. Yeah, I figured I might as well try. Yeah. This morning, um, after having breakfast with my friend, she wasn't on the run for me. We just both were trying to kind of run from a situation uh, that would occur if we had stayed. So we were trying to... She got out because she had cash. I had debit cards. So, of course, that made life complicated. But since then, I haven't done much. Left the house. Went to go grab some stuff from my mailbox. Went to Aldi's got like a whole bunch of kind of condiment stuff for about eight bucks. Kind of some essentials, you know, applesauce for lunch, two things of that, baking sodas, maybe make some cupcakes eventually. Got some pesto sauce and Alfredo sauce because we've got pasta and pasta. If you could get a decent price for some pasta sauce, pasta can tend to be cheap pretty quick, so... Now, I'm going to do some further, further buying and price matching and stuff. So I'm back from grocery shopping. I hit up three different places to spend about $20, 20 round up to about $22 in groceries. One of the things that I got was some, basically, meat, well, kind of hamburger patties. It looks like it might be ground chuck patties. Awesome! And it was only 211 for 1.06 pounds because it was, you know, sometimes they have their meats for a while and people need to get rid of them. Well, you know, it's a sell-by date and if you don't get something sold by that sell-by date, I guess they got to trash them. And you can either cook them immediately or throw them in the freezer. So I'm going to do hamburgers. All right. I'm excited. Well, there's one more right there. And it was so cheap. Um, other things I got, bread, a small thing of cereal for me, <laughs> uh, this, I got all of those things particularly at, um, Save-A-Lot, and at Save-A-Lot I spent seven fifty eight. the cereal was a buck, the chunky soup was like a dollar fifty. The meat, like I said, it was two eleven. I got some Armor All, like, turkey meatballs. This might have been the last time I got turkey meatballs I got from them, too. There's only, like, two bucks. I love saving money so that I have enough money and I can eat and I have food. Um, and I spent, like, about $5 at Walmart and got one of these. It looks good. I'm going to try it out. I had like a 75 cent coupon that I printed off of Swagbucks. Um, it goes through coupons.com, but when you print my, when I print my coupons with Swagbucks, I get like 10 Swagbuck points and I'm saving up to try. I already have enough Swagbucks to get like $25 from PayPal and I've used it before. It's pretty good. Um, so if you don't want to do Swagbucks, you can go to coupons.com. They give coupons all the time. Plus, I got this cheese, pound of mozzarella cheese, and they have this coupon for like a dollar off of any brand pound of cheese. And I was like, well, I know I could go to Walmart and get it cheap, and I know what's the cheapest stuff that they have there, so I knew I was going to get that. And I also got, of course, my soy milk. I ran out a while ago, and I've been drinking regular milk, and I'm happy I haven't had any like reflux issues. And I have other stuff in the car I haven't brought out yet. The Walmart stuff was like five something. The Walmart stuff was like five seventy seven. The save a lot was seven fifty eight. And then I grabbed some stuff from Aldi's, specifically pasta stuff. I told you about that earlier. So I'm excited. Other than me being excited again about cooking, I'm so excited I'm going to playlist. Yay! So who else is going to playlist? 
Uh, I know people have been staring at my stuff every time I mention playlists. It's like, do you be want to be my friend? Won't you be my neighbor? <laughs> I loved Mr. Rogers. And that always sounds like even more funny when you kind of read it at this particular thing. Uh, but, you know, I'm excited. And I don't have to pay for a hotel room. But if anybody would like to harbor me for like one night, I'll take it because I have to drive all the way down to Disney and then go all the way back home uh, during playlist, and that's a lot of gas, so, you know, I'd love to be harbored in your room. Well, I made a hamburger, because the last one I burnt a little too much on one side, so I figured I might as well eat it. Hamburger, romaine lettuce, tomato, there's also barbecue sauce, did I throw honey mustard on this side or nothing? Honey mustard, and there are some Brussels sprouts, well, alfalfa sprouts in there too. And of course you can see the tomato. It's yummy. I don't know if you could see me, but I'm kind of scared to fully touch the camera right now. It's about barbecue sauce all on my hands. Luckily I have the plate in my lap. I have some sauce actually on the fingers that are kind of holding the camera, so. It was a good burger. I'm happy I made myself a good burger. Now I need to go wash my hands. Or, we'll lick them, then go wash my hands. <laughs>